Welcome back, it's Poetry Friday. In fact, it's the first Poetry Friday of the school year. Yay! How about a poem from Christina Rossetti, one of my very favorite Victorians. The Queen of Hearts. How comes it, Flora, that whenever we play cards together, you invariably, however the pack parts, still hold the Queen of Hearts? I have scanned you with a scrutinizing gaze, resolved to fathom these your secret ways, but Sift them as I will, your ways are secret still. I cut and shuffle, shuffle, cut again, but all my cutting, shuffling proves in vain. Vain hope, vain forethought too, that queen still falls to you. I dropped her once, perpense, but ere the deal was dealt, your instinct seemed her loss to feel. There should be one card more, you said, and searched the floor. I cheated once, I made a private notch in the heart queen's back, and kept a lynx-eyed watch. Yet such another back deceived me in the pack. The queen of hearts assumed by arts unknown an imitative dent that seemed my own. This notch, not of my doing, misled me to my ruin. It baffles me to puzzle out the clue, which must be skill or craft or luck in you, unless, indeed, it be natural affinity. It's a fun little poem about playing cards with someone, and that person just always seems to win. But notice which card she always is able to find and pull out of the deck. It's always the Queen of Hearts. So maybe this is sort of a metaphor for uh, people who just seem to be lucky in love and other people who are a bit jealous of that. A lot of Christina Rossetti's poems are about love and about uh, desiring love or losing love, but also she can be very, very playful at times, as I think is true in this particular case. I hope you have a great start to the school year. I'm excited to be back. I'm excited to do more poetry with my students and with you on Poetry Friday. So until next time, you can click down here to subscribe, click over here to watch a previous uh, Poetry Friday, or click up here to watch the next Poetry Friday. And I'll see you next time.